humanitarian aid and diplomacy, interfaith dialogue and Vatican diplomacy. These are just some of the issues discussed during the second day of the conference of the Sovereign Military Order of Malta's Ambassadors in the Magistral Villa on the Aventine Hill, with the participation of Italian and foreign speakers from the world of international cooperation and the Holy See. The debate on humanitarian aid and diplomacy, their ethical dimension and the operational challenges in the current international context saw the participation of Cardinal Gianfranco Ravasi, President of the Pontifical Council for Culture, Giuliano Amato, former Italian Prime Minister, Cindy McCain, Executive Director of the World Food Programme, and Amy Pope, Director General of the International Organization for Migration. Laws and regulations were written precisely to prevent tragedies from taking place and from being repeated. Instead, unfortunately, in the end, all that was foreseen precisely to regulate the potentially dramatic effects of human behaviour has not been applied. Because, as Giuliano Amato said wisely, the defect of international law is that states have the power not to respect it. If we want to speak as the Order of Malta, I think we need to go back to the words of Cardinal Ravasi. Effectively, a push is needed from an emotional point of view. It is no accident that Ravasi spoke of utopia. It is necessary to try to look beyond the simple everyday occurrence and remind everyone that this situation cannot go on. It is necessary to somehow and inexorably return to a context in which certain values can no longer be contained. It is no longer possible to accept that anything can happen and that it happens in any case. It must be understood that there are some interests which, while they are comprehensible, cannot be managed by transcending certain values or the discussion of these values. At that point, it may perhaps be possible to return to a much more normal and much more human relationship between states. And so, in addition to taking concrete action to alleviate people's material or spiritual needs, the task of the Order of Malta is precisely to speak out, to appeal to the international community, to constantly remind people that things have gone a bit too far.